excited to be hopefully the last time to try and do. I've heard so much about it online. I'm super excited. Salama, guys, for being awesome. And thank you for meeting me here for all the bloggers here. It means so much to me, right? So, uh, so you're why, excited? Why are you the things to put up uh, Paris on the line? I'm really excited. I've seen so much. And I, I love this guy. You know, he's got an amazing personality. It's really accommodating. And of course, the food is not expensive. So this is an awesome place for Filipinos to come. And, and it's just so, I'm so happy to be here. This is one of the highlights of my trip. Yes, sir. Seriously. Thank you, thank you. Thanks, guys. Thanks. Sir, what brings you here in the Guata Palace? You know, as everyone knows, I'm a Filipino Filipino culture. And this is such a cool place, you know, where Filipinos could hang out. You know, they could uh, um, uh, experience Filipino food. Filipino culture, and it's just super awesome to be here, so I'm so grateful. Sir, on a scale of 1 to 10, how much do you love the Philippines? 100. Yeah, yeah. yeah. And, and, we know, and we know that. 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 Yeah. 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 Team, no, 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 Ayan guys, ano, puti at iti mga na vlogger, ano At uh, ito yata nga puti ay isang uh, Marcos Royalist din How do you find the uh, Philippines, sir? As you guys know, I've been here many times, around about 50 times over the last three decades. And the Philippines for me is really my home. You know, I always um, become emotional you know, when it's time to leave uh, because I love it here so much. The people are so friendly. And honestly, you know, I've got to say, Philippine customer service is the best in the world. There's no doubt about it. You know, wherever you go, everyone's smiling. Starbucks, people are polite, they're friendly. I don't, I don't think it can be rivaled in any country in the world. So, you know, it's incredible to be here. You just get that vibe, that excitement. You know, everyone's welcoming. It's so good. Cool. And I know all of your plans are last year. The fucking curious uh, you know, you know, uh, I'm, my wife's Filipino, yeah. and because of that, I'm also a Christian, and I do believe that as a Christian, you know, you should pray for the lead, leadership, pray for the country, support the country, and that's my passion as well, you know, supporting the people and supporting what's happening right now. There's been so many improvements in the Philippines over the years. Yes, I remember coming here maybe 20 years ago, where to get from Pankasanan to Manila might take me seven or eight hours. I didn't my bus today in four hours. Now, how incredible is that? You know, with the new roads, with the improvement in infrastructure, it's just it's so uh, cool. Really. It's, it's, thanks so much, guys. It's coming. Yeah, let's do that. Yeah, let's, 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 let's see. Where do I need to go? Maybe just above.
Yan guys, sabutin na lang, pinatay ang music, no? So yan ano, chicken po ang kanyang napili. Right, so it's here. Yeah, no. Oh, yeah. Rice. 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 my family of Pinoy, but I'm passionate about the Philippines and my motive is to try and make Filipinos proud. It's very easy to like bitch about the country and to say bad stuff, but how would we attract foreigners? How do we attract more foreigners to come to the country? We always talk about the negatives. We need to be talking about the positives. I'm not saying there aren't negatives because there are, you know, there's traffic, there's other issues. But, but we don't need to keep on harking on about that. Let's look at the positives to try and encourage more tourists to visit the Philippines. But that's my uh, philosophy. Yeah, like a spoon. Sarah, can I get a little try? No, no, but, but that, that's awesome. Thank you so much. I'm here to tell all you guys the truth about the Philippines in all regions of the world. Yeah. That's the same thing that he said. It's a show the light. And there's yeah. actually way more positivity yeah, in the Philippines and around the world, actually. Yeah, indeed. Than to it's it's vibrant. The people are so friendly. Nature is You know, incredible. I was only in Starbucks the other day. Yeah. And the welcome you get, people are smiling. There, you know, you cannot beat that anywhere around the world. Honestly, you go to a mall, you know, wherever you are, people yeah. are just super friendly and super awesome. And I really feel at home. I feel more at home here than I do in the UK. Don't get me wrong, I'm proud to be British. I'm proud to live in the UK. But I, but having come here for about 30 years now, uh, it's 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 amazing. Let me just have some of this. Uh, this uh, Filipino food like <laughs> since like day one, right? <laughs> I got this t-shirt from Kultori yesterday. Whenever I come here, there's so many, I buy many t-shirts. I don't have the t-shirt, you guys, but I have the heart inside. Ah, uh, yes, yes, yes. You can buy it, guys. Let's try some of the monoc now, some of the skin. With it's the chicken. You want the chicken? Wow. It's really crispy. Yes. Crispy. It's crispy. It's tasty. It's crispy. It's mustard. 
super massive yeah, army. Yeah. And I cannot believe, this is it's only like 120 pesos, right? It's affordable food for Filipinos. You know, some people can't afford to have a restaurant or something. Because life can be pretty tough for some people. But look at the vibrancy of this place. People are eating together. It's a really nice uh, vibe uh, as well. So it's super awesome to be here. Is it your um, first time here? I came the other day just for about half an hour. Wow. And, and so this is not my first time. Maybe a lot of times. Who's that? This is the first time. I love the soup. I have the manok and I have obviously um, some soy sauce and uh, obviously calamansi. Take a little stab. No way, no way. Yeah. So let me see right here. There's three gentlemen. Look at rice. A big stack of rice. Fried chicken. Yeah. Big piece of fried chicken. Go ahead and cut and let's try it. So the last, the last question I want to ask you is about it. What's better? You want the Pares Overload, KFC, or Jollibee's? Okay, so here's the thing. I'm also a big supporter of Jollibee. And I've gone to the opening of all the branches of Jollibee in the UK. And I believe that everything Filipino should be done. You know, the world is, is you know, there's so many Filipino businesses who don't exist. Yeah. It, it would be hard for me to say um, Jollibee is not one of my favorites because it's not. But that, that's the same. Separate business, separate entity. I support Johnny B. I support any, any company that's providing employment for Filipinos, opportunities for Filipinos. But let's move away from Jolly B now and KFC and all the other brands, and let's talk about this. This is why we're here, right? And uh, yeah, uh, this is great. Now let me have some more of the chicken. I'm going to do a taste comparison though between like uh, Jolly B and uh, <laughs> another bite. <laughs> Right, so let me have some more of the uh, manok. Mm. The crispiness of that is just crazy. It's crispier than Jolly Bee. And one of the reasons I like Jolly Bee is because it's crispy. This is like super crispy. And super delicious. Mm. It's like crunching. You can feel the crunch, the sensation of the crunch in every bite. That's really nice. Very nice. What is your what is your piece? So it's a uh, Malcolm Conlan, or just type in British Filipino Malcolm. You see me on Instagram, YouTube, TikTok. One of the TikTok videos I did recently was you know the issue with Benny Blanco when he was vomiting that Filipino spaghetti, <laughs> the Jolly Bee spaghetti, almost like saying it's horrible and spitting it out. So I did like a video on TikTok, and uh, that kind of attracted a lot of interest and support because I believe we should be proud and we should enjoy Filipino food. If you don't like it, don't eat it, don't make a video. There's no need to continue the video if you don't like to eat the food, you know? Only do this if you're doing it with sincerity, not just for the views, it's not about that. If you're doing it because you want to be here, you want to experience it, that's what I have to say. Let me have some more of this delicious soup as well. Thank you so much. Nice. And then some more of this. Guys, I think I'm maybe going to have a chance to meet. Thank you. Did you suggest? Let's take a photo again. Yeah, let's do that. From Canada to the UK, here in the Philippines! Wait, wait, wait. Set up, set up. Set up a press. Okay, ready? In one, two, three. Okay, one more. Make, make sure you get everything, brother. Yeah, sure. Ready, in one, two. And then do one with the wide, wide angle. Wide angle. Wide angle. Back up a little bit and try to get everything. Okay, ready? In one, From two. From UK to the Philippines. All right. Thank you so much. <laughs>
Ay, may sampung gatas. Sampung sa akong pinggas. At may mga sampung sa akong pinggas. Iba ng gatas? Tapos cash. Kay Wamot, ilang pinggas. Wata kay Wamot. Wala pa, wala pa. Pero magbibigay siya. Wata, matukomit ang sama. Salamat na daw ni Wata. Answer to YouTube channel. Tapos sa YouTube channel. Ibigay na lang sa akong sampung sa akong pinggas. Sir, what can you say about the Yun nga, puri nga na nagsabi masarap daw. Wow! What can you say about the Basher of Duwata? Ah, you know, people need to get a life. You know, this is a guy who's actually really creating such a pride, such an advocacy, helping Filipinos. And this is something that's so important, you know. I really, truly admire what he's doing. You know, he's, he's helping to create opportunities for other Filipinos as well. You know, all the people working for him, his staff. It's creating employment and opportunity, and that's what I appreciate. So it's such an honor and privilege to have met him. Thank you, sir. Thank you, thank you, so much. Thank you so much to all of you. I'm so grateful. Thank you, grateful. Thank you.